Today we're going to write a program that converts feet to meters. We're going to do that based off of the user input. As you can see or hear, I already have my class name set up. I'm just going to delete this info up here because that's not really necessary. Alright, so the first thing I want to do is create my main method because that's what runs everything. So I type in public static void main or PSVM tab. And there we are. So the first thing I need to do is tell the user to enter the number of feet. So I type in system.out.println or SOUT tab. I just tell the user enter the number of feet. Semicolon and a space. Then I'm actually going to change this to print instead of a print line just so it looks a little bit neater whenever the user inputs that. Alright, we're going to go down to the next line. And because the user is going to input something, we need a scanner. We need them to type from the keyboard. It's called a scanner. So scanner input equals new scanner system dot in. Alright, uh, you see the computer is having trouble reading that. It's because I forgot something up top here. You always put the imports at the top. So import java.util.star. And there, it's fixed that line right there. It's not read out anymore. So then we need to declare a variable for the user to input. We'll go with double feet. We're calling this feet because that's what the user is going to input. Equals input dot next double. If you're having trouble with this, make sure all your parentheses are at the right place, semicolon, all that good stuff. We're going to come down and we're going to put a little note here so we know what's going on. Calculate meters. And the note's not necessary in this program. But in other programs, whenever it gets more complex, you are going to want notes there. So double meters. So double is my data type. Meters is what I'm calling the data. Equals 0 0.3048 times feet. That's because there are 0 0.3048 meters per foot. I'm going to come down again, put one more comment, and print, we'll call this print, the result. Alright, so I type in the print thing. First, I want to echo the number of feet that the user put in, so I'll type in feet, plus, so whenever I type in feet here, that is the number that the user inputs, so that won't actually say feet. Then I start with some quotation marks. This is orange. Anything inside here is what the user will actually see as letters. So I'll type in a space. Then feet is another space. Then I want to print the number of meters. So, like I said there, that's the uh, actual variable. And it's not going to print the word meters. It's going to print the number. Because that meters refers to this. Which it's going to calculate. And then I need to type in meters. Alright. Oh, forgot a plus sign here. NetBeans always reminds you about that stuff. So if I hit Shift F6, I'm going to run the program, and this should work. It's so running entering the number of feet. Let's say 5,280 feet. That's how many feet are in a mile. That is 10. 1069.344 meters. That looks about right. Alright, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Stay posted, I'll put more up later.